My bad. I completely forgot that I had, didn't have my thing up. Oops. Get that in my <laughs> Oh, good. <laughs> We're here. Uh, let's continue on the game. Uh, I was uh, testing out a new thing. So I want to see how it goes. But uh, anyway, um, I didn't finish off the last episode, so let's just continue on. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, oh, shut up. Sorry, the thing that <laughs> comes up in my uh, voice thing, an advert that pops up, is like, hey, do you want to buy this? No, <laughs> I don't. Uh, Sarah. Hey, Sarah. What are you up to? Oh, hey, sorry, face. <laughs> Contemplating an alternate action for tonight's spy. Oh, yeah, we're to take this. Uh, it's safe before. My friends and I usually like to do our own thing, but I'm having trouble narrowing it down. Okay, if I look uh, over your list? Sure. I think I chose this last time, but I w actually didn't realize I was selecting last time, so... Uh, hmm. D&D, movie night, video games, best tournament, karaoke, and a debate. I chose debate because I just went down to the bottom, but... What I actually find most interesting. D&D, video games, and movie night are probably cool. d and is complicated to set up, so... Video games. How about this? That's usually my go-to choice also. That could work. Alright, can I get past you? Okay, so we're trying to make them quieten down so we can get the crowbar from the creepy guy. Yo, yo, what up, Sal? Hey, CJ. What are you up to? I'm trying to choose the music for our party tonight. Mind if I have a look? Go for it, little dude. Oh, that's nice. Very Pink Floyd. <laughs> Although I love this. No. Hmm. Yeah, I know the guy wants him to be quieter, but fuck it. Love it. Good choice, though, man. <laughs> I agree. Hey, Z. What's up? Hey, Sally Face. I'm trying to choose a game for the party night. Uh, party tonight. I just told her to do that. Oh. How, did, how did it travel when she hasn't even moved? Uh, I've got this little book of games, but I, but I don't know. Can I take a look? Be my guess. Ah, video games is in... Wait, wait, yeah, yeah, yeah I chose video games. Not a... Not a party game. Maybe it's something different. Though. Still loving this. Duck, duck. Duck, duck, moose. Dodgeball. Telephone. Ping pong. I gotta go dodge. I gotta go dodgeball. That'll be fun. How about this game? As f as fun as that sounds, I don't think there's quite enough room in here for dodgeball. Can I look at the book again? <laughs> duck, duck, moose. Grades. Musical chairs. Oh, ping pong then. For this game. Oh, it's been laid to rest. A few months back, old Jimmy fell on and crushed it to pieces. Bang, bang, um. Grades? For this game. That was my first choice as well. Well, it wasn't mine, it was my third. 
Uh, maybe I should just stick with my gut on this one. Alright. Uh, though I like this music, maybe the other guy would like this one to be the selection. How about this? Dude, I think this would put everyone to sleep. I think that's what he wants. Uh, yeah. Um, no, no, video games, video games. I don't know particularly what it did, but I think it might have. What's up, brother? Didn't do anything. Unless... What did he want us to do? Do I need to go find a tape? I'm sure I'm to those, uh, those kids next door in 301. They're nice kids. But they have, they have these real loud parties sometimes. Shake the whole wall and... Show falls right, right down. As you could tell them for me, I, 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 I could let you use both the crowbar. Okay. Hmm. So do I gotta be sure that they're doing quiet things? I don't really know. Make them do a chess tournament. Oh boy. What a great college night. How about this? It's a perfect choice for tonight. Hmm. See what he says about this. I think this could work, yeah. So is that everything keeping it quiet? Let's see. Uh, uh, right, let's go see if there's a tape or something somewhere. I hope I don't get hope I don't get stumped on what to do again. Hmm. Let's talk to Larry. Are you holding up? I'm oh, okay. I just can't believe I've been living in a building filled with ghosts and never realized it before. It makes sense if you think about it. You never, you never sought it out. You didn't even believe in this stuff before. But even if you did see something strange, you probably just wrote it off in your mind as something more logical. No? Yeah, you're probably right. I'll be back. Uh, maybe there. Not nothing new. Hmm. Nope. Oh, oops. Didn't mean to slide that. Anything else? I made a weird click noise there. Nope. Nope, 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 nothing, nothing to drive with. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I am a bit confused. Again. It wants, he wants me to talk to them. But yeah, I can't really do anything beyond just helping them arrange their their, their night. Hmm. <laughs> Confusing. Yeah. Todd, you got anyone? I'm sure Todd has some awesome music. Hey Todd, 
are you up to now? Well, I'm doing some more research and researching out the to the paranormal and and enthusiast on online guy. <laughs> is there some kind of malicious presence in the building there that has there has if there is some kind of malicious presence in the building there has to be some way to deal with it, buddy. Uh, I think you and I need to hang out more often. It's cool. It's cool of you to help me out with this stuff. Any time, any time, sound friend. <laughs> Trying too hard to do that now. Do you have any tapes? Do you have anything I can I can steal now or borrow? <laughs> I'm a shaman. Okay. I don't know what I need to do in particular. Doug's place. And his parents are away. College students. Maybe I just... Wait a minute, let's go in the bathroom. It's funny how they like this. Very opera. Grades. How about this game? Oh, oh, he's doing something automatically. Maybe I just need to choose all the. Yeah. Good, good. Oh, I thought. Um, what was it? Charades? I thought that would have been cool. Huh? Is that better? Can I borrow your crowbar? I worked it all out with the college students. They're going to have a much more low key party this time. Ah, that's great news. I shall have me at. Sorry, uh, Sarah will be so happy. Uh, Sarah. I thought you were saying sorry <laughs> in the sort of way he talks. Sarah will be so happy. We'll be happy too. Last time our wedding uh, picture almost blowed up into pieces. I'm glad I could help. But, right, let me grab that that crow for you. Use uh, one second. I can't do that. I can't do that very well. Here you go, buddy. Take care. Hmm. Thanks. You do. <laughs> right. And what was it we needed it for again? Was it Larry? <laughs> I think it was something with Larry, wasn't it? It's been a day already and I've already forgotten. Oh, wrong way. We needed a crowbar to pry something open. Ah, I got the crowbar. Awesome. Go ahead, with, uh, go ahead without me. I'll be up in a minute. I have to make a stop on the way. Shit, where is it? I go. Oh, wait, wait. It's upstairs, isn't it? We need to pry our way into one of the rooms. Was it the weird guy's room or low upstairs? I'll go check both. Chill. Yep. Yes. No one will ever know it was you and your crowbar. Alright. Let's check for ghosts. Mrs. Sanderson? Who are you? Uh. My name is Sal. I moved in after you died. Oh, I can't remember much of it. Just hazy pieces. Like waking from a dream. You're not speaking from your mouth, and that's concerning. I mean, I guess none of them do, really. Uh, do you know what happened to my, uh, my Herman? Is that her husband? He couldn't bear to come back to this room. 
movers came and uh, took everything out for out for him. He looked totally defeated. You must have bent the world to him. I miss him so much. This cold isolation is uh, torturous. I wish we had never moved to this place. Then he would never met. Uh, then he would never have. have then he would have never met. <laughs> I don't know why that. Uh, it was confirmation there, and uh, Charlie would, would have never. I don't know. It's coming back. Don't don't worry, Mr. Sanderson. Go hide. Uh, go hide. Goodbye, Sal. Achievement unlocked. Unseen. Anyone else? Anyone else? There was another room. There was another room that was boarded up. Unless just not. Anything more out here? No? Yes? Maybe? Hmm. Go check floor, floor five. Any of them? That slow loading is quite creepy. Ah. Nice. Boom. It's the innocent noise of peeling stuff off things. Ooh. Oh Christ. Jesus Christ. Stacy? Are you okay? Oh, does she fucking look okay? Ghost of Stacy. Uh Chapter four, that thing unlocked. Oh. There's a huge hole in the wall where the men can see it all. Uh, it looks like there's a room on the other side. Crawl through the creepy hole. Fuck it. Go. Just be sure... yeah. That's not... Doesn't inspire confidence. Hello? Chapter 7 on. It's forcing me to. Let's, let's go through them all again. The ones I haven't. Curious old woman gazed once again into Jim's eyes and said, If you can find the door, this key. Uh, the, the, if you can find the door, this key unlocks. You will share the secrets of the universe. Oh, the button. Oh, you're going me. Enter. But it's just a maze. No. Oh. That's where I need to go. Right down here. Ah. Almost walked right into that. I don't know what that is. Nope. <laughs> Not that way. It's up here. I think. Oh, right. Around here. Do 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 do. Gotcha. Key. 
Oh, oh, that's how it's done. When her husband learned of her uh, indiscretion, Stacy knew there wasn't much time left and <laughs> left fear for her life. She turned to an unlikely ally. Okay, she said I need to cut the power lines on each floor. Oh, I hope we, oh, we can pull this off. So we just have to avoid these. Ah, they're faster now. Alright. Whoa. 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 Nice. Whoa. Whoa. There we go. Gotcha. There's none here. Okay, uh, Rosenberg. I caught the power on Greg to dispose of the bones. Rosenberg, isn't, isn't that the name of the old lady? Good, and I've destroyed the seventh book. Will we really be able to stop them? We've got a good chance. Nothing is guaranteed, but I think we might have it. we might have done it. Should have never let things get this far in the first place. I'm sorry that Luke had to get your family involved in all this. If we can stop the ritual, then the council won't have another ch won't have another chance to reform it for a thousand years. Then I pray to God this would that this works. God doesn't care about us, my dear. Don't waste your breath on such things. We must fight for our own survival. Alright, uh, chapter 5. We've just done the all in order to be in with two hours. It just weird. But, oh well. Uh, playtime was interrupted by the promptly, promptly setting sun. In that moment, the young girl re realized she had gone far uh, far too deep into unfamiliar world. Ooh. Oh, uh. Do we just keep going? Hmm, and if it takes me back to another... I'm gonna assume maybe... Then... Down? Um... Just try different orders. Down again? Uh, right. Alright. Oh, what do you know? <laughs> uh, where have you been, Chow? You had me worried sick. I'm sorry, Mommy. I, I was lost and it was so dark and... Hush now, my sweet angel. Everything is okay here. I want you to have this. Grandma's necklace? Oh, is this, is this the little girl? It will protect you from the wickedness in this world. So you don't have to be afraid anymore. Yeah, I think this is some stories of the people that live and slash lived here. What about father? He doesn't have to know this. This will be our little secret. Yeah, yeah, I think it is. Chapter 7. In a moment he found himself somewhere else, even though Luke wasn't sure how he ended up here. He knew what he'd done. Uh, the woman is a threat to us. We cannot be trusted. We will accomplish great things together and cannot afford any obstacles. Oh! You're a fucking speed demon. Uh, the child will only slow us down. She will never follow us with her mother's uh, precious blood running through her veins. 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 <laughs> oh. Oops. Oh, almost did it again. Walk with me into the undying flame and our power shall be endless. I need to be gentle. It's far too fast. Can I go down here? Can. Yeah. But it didn't make a difference. Ah. Oh, it doesn't matter. 
Oh. He did say welcome to the flames. Luke? Can you hear me? Christ. Ah. Luke? Oh shit. Did save point of no return. What the hell just happened? Tog gave me one of his inventions. He said that theoretically it could uh, overload and destroy an evil spirit. After I got it, I came upstairs right away to make sure you were okay. Good thing you did. So that red eyed, um, that red eyed creep has been here for decades. That was before I was even born. I guess maybe I'm not cursed after all. Yeah, Uni Addison's apartments had such a da dark past. I thought living here with uh, Charo was freaky. Damn, this shit, uh, this shit is nuts, dude. But I don't think we'll have to worry about the demon showing up anymore. Todd's thing seemed to like. Todd's thing seemed like it took care of it. Oh, what is it? Oh, was that an O or an O? Uh, that's not great at all. I, w I was just thinking. I guess since there's no curse, uh, this all means that my dad, he, he just. And that's sad. Dad, dad was killed. Oh. Oh shit. <laughs> Damn, I should have just continued on for a little longer then. I didn't realize how short it was. I'm sorry, Sal. That's our that's our time for today. The guards are giving me the look. Wait, that was only part of the story. I know, it was only part two of the story. I'd hope to get some uh, honest insight from you today. Especially this being our last session and your trial is just in a, in a few days. In your trial in just a few days. Same thing. I swear in my life, I've told you nothing but the truth. The truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Help me, God. Government, conspir government conspiracies, demons, ghosts, and some kind of magical video game system. Now these things don't exist. You really can't expect me to believe you. Think about it from my perspective. Perspective. The evidence against you for what you did. Oh, it is profound. I know what it sounds, but what I've told you is the truth. Oh, shit. Uh, go to the treehouse, please. Just go and see for yourself. You'll find all the proof you need. Damn it, I missed a bit of dialogue there. Like doing I shouldn't have. What a fucking psycho, eh? No, he wants to somewhat believe, I think. Oh! Do you go into the treehouse? And the house? Addison's apartments look a bit fucked. <laughs> oh. We are Inspector Dude. Uh, what would you call him? Would he be... He's a... Therapist? Or, I, I don't know yet. Or is he purely an investigator trying to figure out what happened? It's just paintings. Rusty toes and other various junk. Floor. A few old, a few old amateur paintings. Probably oh Larry's. Boxes. They're filled with clothes, books, uh, cassettes. Nothing of it. Nothing of importance. Picture. Seems to be a photograph of Larry's parents. Nothing strange about it, though. 
There's absolutely nothing up here. I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking. I guess I just needed to see for myself. Sal was Sal was so convinced, and this and this whole thing had seemed off. Doctor e Doctor Enon Anon. I don't know. <laughs> it's like what uh, Sharon from uh, South Park. What? 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 <laughs> don't forget, man. Yeah, you. We need your help. You have to get Sal. Out of, you have to get Sal out of jail. This shit is is much deeper than we thought. Please. You have to get Sal here. This. You're. You're. You. You can't be. Calm down, dude. You're. You're gonna give yourself a heart attack. This. This is. This is important. If Sal doesn't get here soon, then. Shit. Solari's dead. Well, great. And he is dead. He fell to his death. Keep it unlocked. Conjure. The red ball. The red ball at the bridge. Did I not get a red ball at a bridge? Unless it's just a thing for later. Good, this is going on long. Is this real? Am I dreaming? Someone weird happened to stream mobs there. I think it's still okay though. Seems to seems to have done a thing. Noticed. I'm assuming the sound's still going. It might not be. It might. It might be. I'll, I'll have to see after. But I was do. I was recording a thing before, and it. For some reason, it just for a moment it clicked, and then all of a sudden the screen came back. But now, desktop audio is not registering any sound there, and voice meter audio the thing I use, sounds just gone. So. But when I looked back on the on the footage, it was fine. I didn't I didn't need to stop and start it again. So it should be okay. Others ought to place. Uh, others ought to uh, place. It of, of um. Sort of some words are jumbled. Uh, Is it backwards? I need to see if I can read it. Um, do not be afraid. Do not be afraid. Our... Our, our something here. Sal. Uh, do not do not be afraid. You are. You are sa oh you are safe here. Okay, All right, take me. A do not be afraid. You are safe here, Sal. But you must not. Um. Um. But you must not. But you must not speak of. Um. <laughs> but you must not speak of shit. <laughs> but you must not speak of this place to others. Okay. The only one, the only one who um, believed, uh, the only one who believed you is dead now. What should I do? Um, run. Uh, roll. I don't, I don't know what it would say. <laughs> um. Hmm. Run? Run? Run. Oh shit. I don't know what I'm doing, I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, 
I don't know what this does. I don't know if I'm even doing that right. There used to be a door here. I did. Have I fucked it? I don't know if that was supposed to stop the thing or open a door. I, don't know. <laughs> I definitely didn't do that right, I don't think. Is it true that you have chosen to forego legal help in favour of uh, representing yourself? Yes. Oh, Fox News. <laughs> uh, I've got nothing to hide. Can you speak to your conviction of being an innocent man? Are you, um, sticking with the story you've told the police? I will share the truth. Are you saying your original story wasn't true? I have no comment on that. Can you, come up, can you comment on this, uh, supposed person that allegedly killed your mother? How do you explain no witnesses or, or evidence of any such person? I don't see the relevance of that now. No, because that happened before all this. I had assumed. <laughs> Is it true that they were, uh, they are going to add, add the Sanderson's murder to your chart? That would be news to me. But honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if they tried to pin that on me, on me too. And what about Charlie Man Mansfield? I had nothing to say about him right now. I, I have nothing to say about him right now. Except that I did what I thought was right at, right at the time. Okay, since we aren't getting any major details from you, let me ask you our highest polled question. The viewers are highly interested in this one. Is it true that you are granted special meal privileges because you are afraid of... Oh, you are... <laughs> you are afraid of uh, baloney? Baloney? I think it's baloney. I'm not afraid of lunch meat, okay? I just, well, it's a long story. Bologna. <laughs> Funny how it's spelled. Um, your, tri your trial is still a few hours away. I think we have plenty of time. It's because I don't think get baloney here. I don't think I, I don't really know how to pronounce it. Don't know if that's, if that is how you're supposed to pronounce it from that spelling. All right. Episode three, the baloney incident. <laughs> Mr. Doodle. <laughs> I think I will end that here though. Ash, I think I need to continue on. It's not letting me pause. Nope, it isn't. Fuck. Hello, are you okay? Yep, just the just same. No new dialogue. What's wrong with your friend? He sought the truth and the truth destroyed uh, destroyed his soul. <laughs> these are some... This is some fucking weird little doodles. Now, please leave us alone. Your head will frighten the children. Uh, can you tell me where your friend ventured to find enlightenment? Oh, is, that, is that a hint to Sally? The fact that people find his um, mask freaky. He travelled to the wise prophet beyond the fields of death. But a round head like you will never make it. Adder. Fuck. Hello. Um, are you the platypus? Alright. <laughs> Actually, can I answer them? Nope. I cannot. Fuck. Are you okay? What happened to your limbs? Well, I never. How would you feel if I asked you what happened to your weirdly shaped head? I didn't mean to offend, I was... <laughs> go bother someone else. Alright, I'll go bother them. Hello, miss. Don't pay any mind to my sister. She's been cranky lately because of the sun. It's no problem. 
Our ancestors were mauled by the great beast. Ever since our people were drawn uh, without limbs. What sort of beast could do that? We do not speak of such things. If you want to know more, you will need to seek out the oracle beyond the death fields. Alright. Take it you're the oracle beyond the death fields. Are you the great beast? Well, fuck you too, friend. No, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry, don't pay me any any mind. My temper rises with the sun. The great beast hasn't been seen for over a hundred years. You know where the prophet is? You mean the crazy old hag who lives beyond death? Just take the ladder down, it's always a lot it's it's always a ladder down. Talk. Uh no. Ladder down. Let's go. Ah, an eraser. <laughs> the great destroyer. <laughs> Are you the prophet? I am called many names by the sticks. Do you know about the great beast? It crawled through the great hole many years ago, ravaged the sticks for decades, and laid to rest by a magnificent explosion in the in in the sky. Most believe the beast to be dead, though we know better than that. What is the Great Hole? Eons ago, we created a Great Hole in the paper fabric of this world. And the hole contains all the knowledge in the universe. How do I get there? Uh, what is the truth worth to you? I'm fucking it. Everything. Oh. Can I... We're not, we're not supposed to be beyond this red line. Oh. Tear in the skin of the universe. <laughs> What's up, Pablo? Well then. You able to hear me, Pablo? Uh, excuse me, Mr. Fisher. Because if things happen to Streamlabs, it sometimes does it when... Uh, you're recording, testing out a thing, so. It appears that the desktop audio. Someone who, who is who is not Papple. Now you're just confusing me. <laughs> Excuse me, Mr. Fisher. Now, wake up. Huh? That doesn't look like math to me. Did I just continue on? Oh man, that's a shame. I even lowered um I even lowered the quality. I was thinking I was thinking for that reason. Like I was uh, I was thinking I mean recording and streaming. Uh but I thought well I'll, I'll raise the bitrate of the recording and keep the bitrate of the stream a bit lower so people can have a better chance of seeing, but it's like, oh shit, you can't even, you still can't see even at 720p. Oh sorry, I must have dozed off, I already finished the test. I know dear, you raced it as well, very good. Eh, very good, <laughs> sorry. Uh, just try to stay awake for the remainder of the class, okay? Who the fuck is this guy that looks so pissed? Sure, it, it won't, it won't happen again. And Mr. Phelps, eyes on your on on your own paper. <laughs> Turns back in front of it. <laughs> Class is almost over. Make sure everyone hands in their tests before leaving. Ah, that's a shame. A hey, freak. Nobody likes a goody two shoes Sally face. Nobody likes a cliche Billy Travis. When you have something better, I should think of a different voice for her. When you have something better to do, shut up, bitch! I wasn't talking to you. Excuse me. Don't you call my friend a bitch? You know, if you took that stick out your ass, you might actually enjoy yourself. Uh, you may actually enjoy yourself for once. Maybe even make a friend or two. Not gonna say that. Fuck off. I have more friends than you. You'll ever have. 
piss your daddy with that tongue? I'm sure he... The hell? I... Asshole! <laughs> Are you alright, Sal? I'm fine. Come on, let, let, let's report that jerk. No, don't worry about it. That'll just make that'll just make things worse. Trust me, I've I've dealt with bigger bullies than Travis before. Sal, you're bleeding. I'm, I'm okay, really. Here, let's let's use uh, my bandana. Wait, hold on, I can't. You, you can't. I'm. Oh, he's he's afraid of her looking at his face. That's really cute. There. Looks like it was just a small scratch. Don't worry, you can you can hardly see it. <laughs> Thanks, Ash. Oh, that's 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 really cute. <laughs> yeah, man, they do have a sharp tongue. It's a uh, it's, it's a fun game. I guess when you've got like a, a ma you've got a mask on your face and disfigurement, and there's a bunch of there's always assholes in in high school. You'd have to learn to fight back. <laughs> Dude, what happened? Was it Travis again? That prick, I'll kill him. Larry, Larry I'm fine. It's okay. Don't don't worry about it. Sal's right. If we stirred the pot, it could just make things worse. Not if he's dead. <laughs> then he'll probably just haunt the school and we, we'd be stuck with that bonehead for the next two years. <laughs> Says the group skeptic. You know I love you guys, but the ghost stories are a bit much, even 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 for me. So are we just gonna let that Travis thing go? It's it's not worth it. Plus, think about it. Who knows uh, what his home life is like? He's got a lot of pent up rage. There must be a reason. That is that is true for a lot of people. I mean, it's never an excuse in in your life to just be an asshole to someone, but there's always a certain reason that you know certain people. You just have to have to understand some people. Will, Maybe complete pricks purely because someone is, someone is a complete prick to them in their personal life. I'm pretty sure he's just angry that they switch bologna sandwich day to tomorrow. <laughs> Seriously, I've never seen anyone love the cra the crappiest lunch day so much. It's like a prison meal. He doesn't even like pizza. F he doesn't even like pizza Friday. Who doesn't like pizza? It's inhuman. Maybe maybe he's an alien. <laughs> That's all we need. Psst, Larry. I hope you kill Travis when Sal isn't looking. I heard that. <laughs> <laughs> the next day. Baloney day. <laughs> Knock fell hide. A big ass American flag flying right out front. How American? They're the only ones to fucking do. You don't see any Scottish flags outside our schools. Oh Christ, what? Is this explaining why he doesn't like bologna? Does that bologna smell funny to you guys? I thought. I thought last week was a little off, but oh, yeah, it's it's him with the. I gave him a Canadian voice. I thought last week was a little off putting, but it seemed to be worse this week, guy. Eh? <laughs> I heard it's I heard it's made from goat meat. There's nothing wrong with goat meat. You know, I've I've had, I've had um zebra before. <laughs> then a bunch of kids caught uh, calling sick the day before Bologna Day last week too. Oh, hey, you guys, uh, don't ruin lunch for me, please. It's the only good part of the day. <laughs> Repuddle. I'm in. Me too. Uh, yeah, cat, cat me in. Have, uh, oh, there's a new person here. Maple. Um, have fun. Uh, have fun, guys. I'm going to stay here with Chug. We need to find out if there's anything wrong with the, this uh, bologna. Maybe there was a batch of bad beef where it's expired or something. Or bad goats. I'm telling you, dude, this shit is funky. It doesn't taste like no beef to me. This product most likely uh, this product is, is most likely a blend of low-cost meat components from different sources of beef, gah, pork, chicken, 
Oh wait, different sources of beef pork. I said, I said the Canadian joke guy thing too soon. Uh, different sources of beef, pork, chicken, and or turkey, guy. Todd, man, you're you're making my stomach turn. This is like the hot dog incident all over again. <laughs> I hope not. Sal might be onto something, guy. There could be an issue with the lunch meat. I'd like to take our, our sandwiches to the science lab, buddy. And see if I can find any bacteria or signs of expiration. Trevor, it would be helpful to know what uh, the exact ingredients are, guy. Okay, Ash, you go with Todd and, and help him in the lab. Larry and I will try to get the information on the baloney. Sounds like a plan. Oh, shit. I don't know if that's me or not. That's the issue. I hope not. Bugger off, you stupid fly. Fly flying around my face. Okay. Um, are we able to talk to them? Maple and Chuck. Oh, uh, hi, Larry. Hey, Maple. Aren't you going to eat your lunch? Uh, my, my mom made me peanut butter and jelly again. I'm just kind of tired of it, you know? Uh, I mean, if you're not, I mean, if you're not gonna... Of course you can have it, Chug. Heck yeah! <laughs> Chug seems to like his food. I wonder why. Hey, it's this asshole. Travis. I thought I smelled trash. What are you, what are you flamers up to? Get Ben, Travis. Don't you have sandwiches to attend to? Your luckiest baloney day. Come along, Larry. Kim. That's the name of the... Guy with the sort of strange boils on his face. Hi, Kim. We want to ask about the bologna. Could you tell us where the school buys it from? Hey, you want to know about the bologna, eh? Something wrong with Kim's cooking? No, no, no. We we, we, we just were wondering where it... You kids go and sit back... Uh, you kids go and sit back to chairs now. No, no more questions. Do you think we could just see the package or... No packages for you. Just butts in chairs. Go on. Oh shit. Oh, that was a failure. She always seems so unhappy. I wonder I wonder why she stays here. Ah, it's Kim as in a lady. Uh it's like the kids make her sick or something. Dude, what if Kim is uh, poisoning the poisoning the lunches? I don't know if this I don't know if this town has room for another conspiracy theory. Though I guess it's worth looking into. Why don't you see if you can sneak into the principal's office and look at the, and look at her files? While you do that, I'll check with, uh, in here with Todd. For God's sake, that fly is annoying me. Alright, I'll see what I can do. Is there a... Hi, Travis. What do you want? Am I allowed to leave? Apparently, yes. You can just go. Oh, um, any luck? The teacher are, are all in the lounge. I'm waiting for the right moment to sneak by. Ah. Cafeteria. Pleasure. Anything in here? I don't have my game gear. Open all the toilets. Ah, nothing there. Back the trash. Nope. Nothing in here. <laughs> I better not. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Fucker. Okay. Got a paper clip. Yep. Uh, we'll save that for all of them. Yeah. Oh, shit. Uh. Back in this side of the cafeteria, I guess? Yeah, sleep. Hmm. 103. Glass in right now. Ah. A paper clip. Yes, yes, good. Good. Progress. Hmm. Alright, let's open... Thalslocker. 
Just sign my text, please. Todd suggested I take uh, physics this year, and I'm actually enjoying it. The world we live in is fascinating and filled with, uh, with mystery. Oh, look at them. There's a photo of them all in, like, ninja gear. That's, that's cool. Uh, you're back. I've had this backpack since I started going to school here. It's a little worn around the edges, but it's still good. I, I get that. Let's uh, check out the photo. Picture of us from Halloween. That was so fun. I, I'm, I'm lucky to have great friends. Me too, man. Me too. Uh... Ashes locker? Ash makes these stuffed dolls. I think they're cool. We call them little dudes. <laughs> Ash is out of supplies. Ash and Larry are such good artists. They try to teach me, but I'll, I'll never be as good as they are. Same thing, man. I mean, I don't have anyone that really teaches me, but I'm just not very good at art. Okay, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm okay at copying things, but... I have fun painting and drawing with them, and they, ne they never make me feel bad for not being good at it. That's that's the sign of a good friend. Hey, that's me. I didn't I know I didn't know she had uh, this in her locker. Oh, does she have a crush on YouTube? Some of Ash's photos. One is an older picture of her and Larry. So glad I met those two. All right, that seems to go. Ooh. Camera. Let's take it. Lockers. Um, I already went to my locker. All right, it just highlights Todd's locker. Uh, ah, <laughs> oh, does Todd have a boyfriend? Todd and his boyfriend Neil. They're always so happy when when they're together. That makes me happy too. I'm sure it's the accent. He must love the accent. Hey there, gay. <laughs> Todd is never short in supplies for his inventions. I don't know how he does half the things he does. The guy's a genius. Not much of a surprise that Todd, Todd's lockers are they're half filled with books. I really admire his passionate, passionate curiosity and hunger for knowledge. Uh, hey look, Pavel, it's your computer. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> He's got a light bulb powered by a potato. <laughs> This potato-like thing was a science experiment that Todd showed in class. I'm surprised it's still going. I mean, potato power be strong. Liar's off. Oh man, he's got corn. Uh, headstones. I think corn is the only one that looks to be an actual band, you know, reference. At the greats, type positive. We are void. Saints, um, fall, fallen. I think yeah, I think that's what I said. I didn't. I don't think I read that right last time. That's one of my paints. I was gonna throw it out, but Larry insisted on keeping it. He said, "Great art doesn't need to be beautiful as long as it conveys genuine emotion." And I feel that I feel the shit out of this man. I really do. What the fuck is that? I think that's an older drawing that Ash made. She, she actually thought Larry. Uh, she actually taught Larry a lot of what he knows now. He's a great teacher. We may never be uh, yeah, we ne we may never have became close if it weren't for Larry. Oh, uh, oh, and he also has the same picture. That's cute. Larry's art stuff. He's so messy. <laughs> In a way, I I sort of admired that carefree mindset. He's got he's got a uh, thing saying creeper. Your potato is stronger today. <laughs> nice battle. Uh, Larry's backpack. We've been through so much over the last two years. He's more than just my best friend. He's family now. I don't know what I'd do without him. Oh. Well, that's all their lockers. Close. Let's go check out the other lockers. Oh, um... Was it all, what, did I only need the, um, camera, was that? Yeah. It appears so. Oh, I got the paperclip and the camera. Cafeteria. Read. Oh, we too. Let's go down. Science lab. 
Uh, Todd said he was going to be in here, so... Find anything? Not yet, guy. Were you able to get the baloney ingredients? No, not yet. Where's Ash? You're meant to get some uh, materials for me, guy. I recommended she uh, look in the janitor's closet. I thought she'd be back by now, actually. Yeah, back. Okay, so I need to go get... Uh, some things. Aw, oh, man. I thought you said your potato was strong today. And, and welcome the real Pablo. Oh, <laughs> yeah. A baseball. Come on, yeah. And it's got a smiley face on it. Alright, so... Asher's camera. There isn't much film left in it. Just a normal tennis ball. Found it in the, court, uh, in the courtyard. Yes, I know you. Right here. The hall. Oh. Window. The teachers are in there. I need to find a way to get their attention without seeing me. Maybe if I make a loud enough noise. Bro, it. Huh? What was that? I don't know. It sounded like it came from outside. I don't see anything. Neither, I, neither do I. Hey, there's someone with pink, <laughs> with blue pigtails there. Maybe, maybe it was those damn birds again. And I throw it again. Maybe it was enough of a, of, of a distraction. Wait, wait, what's my jibs? Help Ashley. Can't see them. They must be hiding. Yes. Indeed they must be. They are birds. Alright. Did you get past? Yeah, good thinking with the distraction, dude. I saw our file. Awesome. Anything to help us? Well, I had to book it, so I didn't get a good a good look, really. If you can distract the teachers again, maybe I can just take the file. No, we don't we don't want to draw attention to ourselves by stealing the file. All right, you're the boss, Sally. So what should we do? Give me a minute. I'll, I'll think of something. Hmm. Eh. What do we do? Hmm. Too sure, to be honest. Can I just throw a tennis ball at them? <laughs> Maybe we need to piss off this guy. Hey, South Face. How's the detective work going? Not great so far, but we're still looking on it. You guys are wasting your time on this one. I'm telling you, this is good below. This is good baloney. Nothing wrong with it. But that's just because you're a fucking bass. <laughs> no offense. <laughs> you, you just seem to enjoy food. I mean, I can't talk, so do I. <laughs> Everything tastes you tastes good to you, buddy. <laughs> she has a point there, Chug. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In any event, I hope you're right. Now, uh, what do I gotta do here? Shit. What do you want? Okay, nothing to do. Let's get out, old boy. Leave me in peace. Alright, alright, alright. Nothing we can do here. Shit. Shit. <laughs> Fucking love that. Right, nothing here. No. Is there no way of using the camera for something? Hmm. Not nothing here really, but. Hmm. 
Eh. Eh. There's a class for, uh, in there right now. Is there anything else in this here? Uh, in this room? Nothing else? Nothing else? Nothing at all? Nothing? I always like these kind of boards with uh, the times table. Science lab. 202. There's a class in. Oh, shit. Fuck. Oh. Ah, sugar. Hey, what's wrong? Damn closet locked. I need I need something in there uh, to I need something in there to, in, in there to test the baloney. I tried to pick the lock that Larry showed me, but now the the hairpin is in, is stuck in in the keyhole. Jammed up good. I was reading this complete wrong. Hmm. Could you use uh could you use some pliers to get that thing out? But yeah, they'd be in the closet <laughs> or in the janitors. But he always uh, leaves for lunch. I'll see what I can find. Thanks, and in the meantime, I'm going to keep trying to get this out. Alright. Nope, the universe ends there. Courtyard. Uh, where is the janitor? Maybe I can go past Larry. Also, I need to see someone just for a minute. Just for a minute, nothing's happened. I just need to test a thing. No, and whenever I go out of this, the, the game just freezes. There we go. Alright, all's, all's good. Huh. CV usage is actually very low, recording and streaming at 720p. I guess it's just when you bump it up to higher settings, it just turns shit. <laughs> uh, can I get past? Um, okay, I think I entered it in that way before. There's no door to a hall, to a janitor's closet in there or something? No. No. It. Uncertain of where to get what I need then. Oh, hello. I did a full loop. Oops. I didn't really mean to, but I was forgetting that this was back there. 103. Cafeteria. Maybe there's something else in these little lockers. Hmm. Doesn't appear to be. Hot soccer? Hmm. No, just the same. Shit. Then what can I do in here? There must be something I can do in here. Wouldn't give you access to this toilet just for nothing, would they? Help Larry. That's what I have to do right now. But um I don't know how Hmm. Do I need to just throw the thing again? Um Here, use Asher's hammer to oh, oh, use Asher's camera. <laughs> use, use Asher's hammer. <laughs> Sorry, I, I, I'm just surprised that I, I guess I, I guess it's because I already went and got the camera. I, here, use Asher's camera to take a picture of the files. Great thinking, dude. Ready when you are. All right. Now we go. Okay, good, good. That wasn't that long. Didn't take too long. Showtime. <laughs>
throw it. Oh, what was that? I don't know, it sounded like it came from outside. Just like that noise from earlier. <laughs> I don't see anything. Neither do I. Maybe it was those damn birds again. No, I just, it wasn't me. <laughs> I'm, I'm here after that. Did you get it? Dude, the file is missing. What? How can that be? No one else could have went in there without you seeing it. Without you seeing them. Just jerking you just jerking your chain, man. I got I got the picture. <laughs> Don't do that to me. Oh you, you buzz no you, you butt nozzle. <laughs> Score. Let's, let's let's take a look at it. Kim Yazzie, um, born nineteen sixty seven. Uh oh, it's like a that's like my brother was born the eighties, but he was born on the eleventh of December. Of course. Big family no uh blah blah Greg and blah. Education, GED, uh, Pierce Employer, Amateur Nature Photographer. Kim as, um. Oh, ah. That's what it is. L, L, Elephantitis. It is not contagious, and she is, um. sensitive to it. Make sure the other teachers know. Tell Kim to stop feeding the birds uh, birds in the courtyard. Other teachers getting annoyed. I think I know what to do. I'll meet you back in the lab. You got it, dude. Oh, yeah, I was forgetting that. Sally's fit. Sally is like grey. But the, you forget that with the fact that they're like blue hair. But yeah, it's like a very odd skin tone. Alright. Back to the lab. Probably a quicker way I could have done this, but uh, it doesn't matter. Oh, wait, size up. Right here. You get the blowny yet, dude? I'm working on it. Ah, so we need to go. Still need to help Ash. Hey, look, it's uh, Einstein. Alright. I don't know what to get from you. A new rocket? Nah, this pin is still stuck and they're good. Okay, let me know if, uh, if... I'll let you know if I find anything useful. Thanks, so. Alright, my neck is getting... Oof. Ow. Hey, uh, Science lab. Any pliers in here? Uh, just check for a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh... Ooh. Sticky st sticky tack. This might be enough. Maybe. Possibly. Hey, maybe you could use a sticky tack to get that pin out. Well, for sure. Squelchy noises. Awesome, it came out and I was able to get the door unlocked too. I must have been close to getting open with, with the pin. Alright, now, now I've got uh, what I, I need. Time to head back to the old lab. Cool. I'll meet up you, uh, you and Todd in a little while. I have to figure out a way to get the ingredients first. Okay. How to do... How to... Do. I love this music. Alright, um... Cafeteria. Nothing else in there. Let's go check for a minute. No, here's not. Up here. Uh, what can we do in here then? Sorry, being a bit quiet. Nothing appears that I can do. What do you want? Nothing strange there. Um, any for you guys? Yeah. 
good. I am stumped. Um, maybe I can show her the file? I don't know. Wait, wait, what was it? Um, how to process some lunch late, education, GED, previous employment, amateur photographer, notes. Tell him to stop feeding the birds in the courtyard, other teachers getting annoyed. Uh, can I show you any of these things? I don't know. Maybe I can go past now that Larry's... Ah, I can. Hmm. Can't, Can't leave. Oh, come on. It's a whole new section, but there's nothing here. Ah, shit. That's the teacher's lounge, yes, I know. Okay, I don't know what to do. Maybe I need to do it again? What was that? I know, it sounded like it came from outside. Uh, birds. Hmm. No, I can't throw it at the birds. <laughs> hmm. Use. Ah. Where are you? <gasps> Cheek. Oh. Well. So, have we got to go... Give this to her? Hmm. Maybe. Uh. Uh, do you have to talk to her, maybe? Oh. I got something for you. Yeah, we do. What's this? A photograph? Of Birdie! You, you take pictures, eh? Yeah, I took it for you. Just a small thanks for all the hard work you do. Yes, <laughs> I forgot what her voice was. You're a sweet boy. You're a sweet boy, Sally. Thank you. I was wondering, can you tell me where the school buys the bologna from? Why are you so interested in bologna for? Oh, well, uh, my friend and I really like it, and we want to know where we can get some. It's, it's local made by Miss uh, pa Packerston. 100% beef. She brings uh, from farm once a week. Here, I give you some extra meat for bringing Kim a nice photograph. Oh, thank you so much. You're not so bad. <laughs> Alright, I got the bologna. All's well. All's good. We. Again, there's probably a quicker way than walking down the hall here, but... Probably doesn't make much of them. Yeah, I did it. Got more bologna. Perfect. Kim said that, that it's made by Miss Packerston. Whoa, no way, dude. She, she lives in the apartments. How can she make her own lunch meats? Oh, yeah. I forgot she lives there. I hardly, I hardly ever see her. I've probably seen her in the building twice since I moved here. She tends to return at late hours. Oh, wait, that's that's Todd. Wait, I was was that Larry talking before? Um, she tends to return late, uh, return at, at late hours. I think the last one was Todd saying that. At late hours. I believe that she keeps multiple jobs, yeah? Teachers don't get paid as well as you may think. It's probably uh, fairly common, buddy. However, when, Mr., uh, when Mrs. Packerson is home, she makes quite a lot of noise, buddy. It's very peculiar. What, 
so what do we do? We Should we ask uh, Paxons about this odd business of hers? Or are you boys going to do your whole detective thingy? <laughs> I don't know about you. What do you think, Sal? Let's do a little snooping before going to the Packers. I don't like the way this is playing out. Something uh, nefarious is going on. I'd be at best, uh, it'd be best not to let Paxson know that, that we're looking into it. Agreed, buddy. <laughs> um, good luck, Sally. All right, why don't why don't you and Larry go check uh, out Mrs. Paxson's classroom while well, the teachers are on break? Todd and I will finish testing this baloney. Exactly what I was thinking. Oh, oh, wrong voice. Exactly what I was thinking. Okay, um, we'll be back. Go check out the classrooms. Find out the secrets. Larry, I'll need you to be my lookout. Wait by the door in case anyone comes down here. You got it. Alright, alright. It's, it's, uh, uh, th damn, she keeps her desk lore locked. Desk lore? <laughs> or her desk drawer locked. Uh, do you remember how to pick the locks like, uh, like I showed you? Yeah, but there's no keyhole. A combo lock? Shit, dude. How the hell are we gonna get that thing open? Let me take a look at it. Um. One on one, one on one. Two. Two, two, four, five. Two, two, four, six. Three, three, one, three. But <laughs> surely there must be a code. Unless is it this? Three one four one. What do you know? <laughs> Gotta open. That's nice one, dude. What's inside? Just a bunch of math papers and. Hold on, there's there's a hidden compartment. Man, there's some freaky ass stuff in here. What is it? I'm not sure. Oh. Little jars filled with what looks like spices? Maybe for cooking? Why does she have a bird skull in here? That's, that's kind of creepy. Is that that thing for strange metal objects? Similar to Jim's puzzle box. This could be important. Yeah, I'd take that. There's another one of those metal boxes, like the... Shit. Is it happening again? Yeah, I... Oh. Um... I have no fucking clue what that would say. Uh... Are you sure? You could just be dehydrated. You didn't eat anything for lunch either. It's done. Huh? It's already over. But, never mind. Let's go check in with Todd and Ashley. Though he has some sort of strange episodes happen. Hey guys, we found some sketchy things in Parkinson's desk. Where are the tests coming? We're not getting any signs of harmful chemicals or bacteria, buddy. Harry, I think we can all agree there is something peculiar going on here. Whatever it is, let's not mention this to Chug for now. The poor kid almost had a heart attack when they stopped serving meatloaf. Yeah, Ash, um, yeah, Ash is right. Let's keep this under wraps until we know for sure what's going on. Well, I guess we know what we have to do now. Damn. I'm gonna miss the action again. I have to watch Ben until my parents get home. Maybe I can help out after that, though. Me. Later that day. I need a few minutes to get it ready. Okay. <laughs> That's cool. I have to take care of something first anyway. Okay, let's meet up in Todd's room once uh, once everyone's ready. Yes, perfect. Cool. Alright, well, I think I'm going to leave that here. Uh, we'll come back to this another time. I, this it may be the case again that this isn't as long as done, but I think I'll just leave it here. Okay. Thanks for joining. Uh, we'll see you later. Bye-bye.